This clip is brought to you by SaveWithConrad.com. We're in active bankruptcy, so eventually the WBF's legal department uh, handles some of that, and ta-da, now they own it. Uh, we should also mention that Terry Bam Bam Gordy unfortunately passes away on July 16th, which coincidentally you and I are recording on July 16th. So as you and I are speaking today, Jim, it's the 20 year anniversary of Mr. Gordy's passing. What do you think his legacy will be in the business? Unfortunately, that, uh, apparent drug induced death, uh, because that's a sensational way of looking at it, especially in today's uh, world of, uh, uh, internet feedback and fans that have a lot of knowledge, at least they think they do more often than not, but they let's not forget. He I've been told by guys that were, uh, that I truly respected Watts, Ernie lad, uh, golly, Terry funk, a lot of guys that were, that I hold in high, high regard that said he was the greatest teenage wrestler they ever saw in their life. He was really, really good Conrad at 16. Right. A big kid, big athletic kid. Uh, but he had, but his instincts for wrestling and his uh, psychology and his timing was, uh, just absolutely uh, amazing. And I think him hooking up with Michael Hayes early was a good thing for, for Bam Bam because Hayes was a student of the game and was way ahead of the curve. Of, uh, most guys I knew as far as being a smart guy and a good strategist and, uh, and they, they were both hungry. But Terry Gordy should be remembered as one of the greatest big men workers, 300 pound workers ever. Unfortunately, much like Chris Benoit, he's not going to be known for his remembered for his wrestling. He's going to be remembered for how he died. And that's not cool. Let's talk about, uh, the go home angle for this pay-per-view. Hey, hey, it's Conrad Thompson. Thanks for checking out the podcast here on YouTube. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and the notifications bell so you get a notice anytime we upload some new content. And go save yourself some money right now. If you're in a 30-year loan or you have credit card debt, it's not a matter of if I can save you money. It's a matter of how much. Find out right now for free at SaveWithConrad.com.